right, this morning I was basically on a snap on truck politicking, you know, with the snap on rep. Um, you know, I've seen this flyer and this catalog online. Um, but while I was on the truck, I just happened to uh, pick one up, as you can see. Um, so in the truck this morning, there's a few things that technically I needed. He had actually one of the items. The item is kind of expensive. Seen it on eBay for a little bit more cheaper. So still debating. He only had one of them left. I told him to hold on to it for me. You know, maybe I'll pick it up next week or the week after next. The way he is, he'll hold on to it for me. I, he could have just gave it to me or, you know, I could have just took it, but I didn't want to just take it on an arm like that because the item is basically kind of expensive. But um, <clears throat> while I was on a truck, I just happened to pick up this uh, catalog. I have seen this catalog uh, online, and there's a couple of other people who um, basically put this on YouTube, shot videos about it, so on and so forth. Um, but as I was looking into it get over here I was looking at these tech angles right here and I just happened to notice as you can see the price range on the quarter inch drop tech angle which is 449 and then for the half inch um, they got it on a deal right now for 530 I don't know from a quarter inch to a half inch and the price differential I don't know what you think about that but then I'm looking over here at this 3 8 electronic 3 8 drive Michael torque wrench which is from 5 foot pounds to 100 foot pounds and the price range on it is 567 dropped down from $630 and then as you can see What's so funny, right, about the quarter inch, take a look at the price at $4.99 for $4.49, and then you got the half inch at $5.89 for $5.30. So, I don't know. Item like this, um, just my personal opinion item like this I wouldn't buy second hand or buy um, online item like this I actually prefer to actually buy directly from the company or from the tool truck so that I get paperwork on an item like this I can't see myself um, purchasing something like this on eBay or purchasing it second hand um, without paperwork of ownership or receipt or something like that especially if I need to have some um, warranted or I need to have it uh, recalibrated or something like that but that's just basically what that is and then over here you can see what they have available got the heavy duty fan the 3500 lumen coilless floodlight for 166 Got some diagnostic equipment, video scope at 525. Scope with dual 8.5 millimeter imager for 517. A digital tack advanced time and light tool. Price range is at 387.90. The air chuck forty five dollars. This is fine. On one hand, it's healthy, but on the other hand, it's delicious. Healthy, delicious, healthy. 
Let's start up there. Some extractors. Yeah, extract the set. That's crazy. For the 13 piece hex head fast and extract the set. That's only 13 pieces. I just bought a 10 piece set and I paid about $34 or $40 or something like that. Brand new on eBay. That was a little come up purchase for me. I think I did a, um, a little uh, small review on it, but I never actually um, opened the item in the, in the hole. What caught my attention uh, is this 1200 lumen underhood clamp light right here. As you can see, price range is 170 55 And as you can see in illustration, because you know with the magnetic nights, you don't always basically, um, some hoods, you know, they have the lining underneath the hood. So sometimes you don't always have um, a good surface to get your lumen light connected, magnetic base connected. Like, this is a good option right here. Where I work at in my shop, text bodies time and time over again, losing them like crazy every five seconds in the shop, sticking them underneath the car, forgetting that they had them stuck underneath the car. They take the car out the shop to give them off to the customers, then they turn around and remember that they had the lumen light connected to the car while they were working. See what they got over here. Got some more blue point stuff. Not even really into a blue point like that, but Let's see what they got back here. They got some gloves, some safety glasses for 1170, black and red. They got some snap-on gloves, thirty-four dollars. Got these over here, thirty-one dollars. But yeah, I don't know. But as y'all always know, Snap-on is expensive. So you know, if you don't know a rep or you don't deal with a rep or a tool truck like that. Some of your snap on items, not for nothing, I would suggest, you know, shop around on eBay. I wouldn't even shop on Amazon, because basically on Amazon, you basically still almost basically paying about the same price as if you were to basically get it online from the snap on store. But that's just basically what it is. And these deals are from July 15th to August 31st. As you can see, they got the welding equipment. Alright. So I'll get back to you later. I'm on my lunch break right now. About to get off and clock back in. So I'll check y'all later. Peace.